Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, Steve here with another edition of the mouthpiece pressure reducer. We back at it again. Like, like it's day one. Uh, it's October 20th. We're going to hit this one off uh, with, we'll start with some lip slurs again. Very foundational uh, concept, exercise, uh, whatever you want to call it, to being a well-rounded trumpet player is playing lip slurs. Uh, so that way you can smoothly move through the instrument without a lot of hiccups. So this is going to be a little bit more challenging because I got the mouthpiece pressure reducer on here, but that's the whole point. So let's get after it. Thank <laughs> you. 
actually quite surprising. I thought it would sound worse than that. But, good job. Let's try it again. tried it but I'm gonna try to go through the three partials or at least the three notes that I can play with the same thing right together to do the second part. Hold on. Okay, so I'm back. All right, so now I'm just gonna do some articulation stuff um, just to give me, so the slurring 
is one thing, articulation is another, which also applies some pressure when you articulate. So again, I'm trying to avoid excess pressure. So this is why I'm using this device and it's gonna ultimately help me, you know, have a longer career playing trumpet. So here we go. Um, another thing uh, and your arms are getting like my arms are getting tired from holding the instrument so the natural tendency is to force the instrument closer to my face which this device won't allow me to do because if I do that I can't play any sound Thank <laughs> you. 
goes again. there um this has been another edition of the mouthpiece pressure reducer um yeah things are going great it's getting better one day at a time we laying these bricks one day at a time just going to keep working at it because eventually this will be so so easy and um yeah i can't wait for that day to happen until then ride with me i catch y'all on the next one i gotta walk to the camera peace peace